Naheem Hines, a name that I wasn't familiar with, but now I know the name of Indianapolis. Greg, tell me why you are looking at him as a potential waiver wire pickup. There's certain places you don't go for the running game. Seattle before Chris Carson, like last year, perfect example of that. Tampa Bay this year. And so is Indianapolis. Marlon Mack's been injured. Jordan Wilkins hasn't been good enough. Kristen Michael's been cut. And Naheem Hines just hasn't done anything on the ground. So the Colts and Frank Reich did what you're supposed to do. You abandon the run, but not the run game. What do I mean by that? Short passes that essentially act as running plays. Through three games, Naheem Hines has been targeted in the passing game five times in three of those games. Last week, Nine receptions, 63 yards, and two touchdowns. He's become a stabilizing force in that backfield that simply cannot run the ball, but needs to be able to do something besides pass the ball down the field to players like T.Y. Hilton, which we'll get to a little bit later on. Naheem Hines, he's really, really good in the passing game. And many ex experts coming into the league, coming into the year, thought that's what Hines could be. Frank Wright in Philly? He had passing down backs. It wasn't just all a Jay Ajayi last year. As we all know, it was Darren Sproles and Corey Clement after him. Wherever Frank Wright goes, mid, uh, San Diego before that, he had a passing down back. Danny Woodhead comes to mind. If Naheem Hines could be this year's Danny Woodhead, you have a potential star in your hands, an every week starter. That's what Naheem Hines could represent. If he's out there on your waiver wire, I strongly suggest picking him up and putting enough money down in your fab and putting that high waiver claim in to make sure you get him. This one is a game changer. It reminds me a lot of Saquon Barkley and the New York Giants. And no, I'm not saying Hines is like Saquon. But, you know, offensively, when you have a team that isn't potent, what do you do? You, you end up dumping off a lot of short passes, and it seems like Hines could be the beneficiary. Uh, definitely agree. Great option for a waiver wire pickup this week.